Some sunny skies to fly through. Uh, yeah. And uh, I think we have some of that for the next, what, 24 hours? 24 hours, maybe 36 hours. Things are looking gorgeous. Start for your holiday weekend, but uh, you may run into some turbulence if you're taking things uh -huh. by uh, travel, by flight this uh, Memorial Day weekend as you get closer to Saturdays. Sunday's not looking that bad. And then for the holiday itself, we got some more damp weather to talk about. But hey, let's enjoy the nice sunny skies while they last across much of the area. 79 degrees. It's hard to top that, folks. Mostly sunny with a uh, light breeze around 5 miles an hour. Humidity has taken a step back and so are these dew points. So that means crystal blue skies, not a cloud to speak of on satellite and radar, at least most of us north of I-76. Different story down to the south, and here's why that same front we experienced yesterday uh, afternoon and evening that gave us those thunderstorms. We have a little bit more moisture that's hanging out to the south of us. So yes, upper 70s and dew points are slightly uh, higher down to the south. So that's going to be the focal point or possibly more cloud and possibly a sh straight shower too as we conclude the evening throughout the overnight. But most importantly, as we get started for early Friday morning, yes, uh, some dense fog could be possible for our southernmost communities near Dover over to Tuscarawas County. But outside of that, a sunny start for your Friday morning. Things are looking good with a uh, north breeze for the morning rain to the early afternoon temperatures rebounding into the upper 70s low 80s here's your national design right hourly forecast not much to really speak of high pressures in dominant control things are looking gorgeous to conclude your work week going into your weekend we have increasing humidity and usually when we have increased humidity that means Yes, those rain chances are going to be ramping up with our next uh, storm systems is going to be ramping up and giving us our first wave of showers and thunderstorms as early as Saturday morning right into the early afternoon. Here it is right now on the map moving out of the mountain west right into the front range of the Rockies already generating some showers and thunderstorms in South Dakota. No severe storms for us. As a matter of fact, by the time this storm system gets to us, our atmosphere is going to be much stabilized. But nevertheless, by Saturday morning, that is what we're looking at for our first round of showers and storms. But I really want to highlight Saturday uh, afternoon, evening, right into Sunday. As of now, things are looking quiet as high pressure builds in. Then here's our next inbound storm system. As early as Sunday night into much of Monday, check out these ISO bars. That's going to be a driving force of the wind. So a bit breezy with showers and storms for Sunday uh, night right into Monday morning for Memorial Day. Yeah, this upper level low is going to be hanging out and giving us another round of showers, maybe some breezy conditions for early Tuesday and most importantly, a cool end to the month of May. Here's your Medina Country Club seven day outlook for Memorial Day, upper 70s, showers and thunderstorms, breezy conditions. Tuesday, getting a jump start in your work week, low 70s to upper 60s for highs, but rain chances lasting through much of next week. Alrighty. Well, thank you so much. Sure. Appreciate it.